A new charter school is set to open in St. Louis City next fall. The Missouri Department of Elementary and Secondary Education approved the application for Believe STL Academy. The approval calls criticism from supporters of St. Louis Public Schools. Tonight, First Alert 4's Alex Gall has reaction from the director of the new charter school. The city is failing the black community. Parents opposed to the opening of Believe STL Academy, a new charter school slated to open next fall in St. Louis. They're taking resources away. Specifically away from St. Louis Public Schools, which is already facing declining enrollment. The way you destroy a community first is you have to destroy the educational system, and that's what they're doing. It's a vocal group of parents and advocates who call themselves Save Our St. Louis Public Schools. They argue charter schools are a for profit gamble with taxpayer money, the odds not worth taking when the money could go towards struggling public schools, affordable housing and violence prevention. The last thing on the list of our needs is another set of experimental charter schools. But the school's director, former SLPS teacher Kimberly Neal Branham says her school is worth the investment to keep families from leaving the city altogether. People are frustrated and want to figure out as a city, how do we figure this out for all kids? And I want to say that we're a part of those people too. Believe is being funded by a part of a $35 million government grant given to local charter school funder Opportunity Trust. We can argue about who funds what. What we can't argue about is that we all want our kids to be successful. The school received approval from the state board last week amid a lawsuit from SLPS alleging Believe did not notify them of their intent to open. Neil Branham disputes that. Um, I'm not coming to fight. I'm not coming to the city to be adversarial. I want to figure out how to work together and partner. Believe STL Academy is still looking for a permanent location, but is already enrolling students for next fall. In St. Louis, Alex Gall, First Alert 4.